hey y'all welcome back to my channel y'all today was my first day of work uh, she's a working girly yes ma'am and i love my job so 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 much i do i do i not they on the corners again oh, okay but anywho yeah first day was a success my first day is actually halloween day girl but um yeah, so I was like kind of forced to do a little bit of trick-or-treating. But, you know. So luckily I live pretty close to where I work at. So I can just go home and I have a one hour break, baby girl. And it's very much so needed. It is. It is. But I love my job. I love kids. So this is like the perfect job for me. Some of them are a little too much but I have patience so I can deal with it but what am I going to eat oh, y'all it's actually some girls in there that are my age I'm excited to build um, friendships with them they are really nice everybody is just so nice and I can tell like it's genuine and I love that for me like y'all God is so good I am so blessed. I really am. What are you doing? Oh, that's a lady. Oh, she planting flowers. Oh, she's so gorgeous. <laughs> and I had stopped and got me some gum too, girl. Turn your car off, Leah. Okay. I need to go in and hurry up, baby. I only got an hour. So y'all, here is the work fit for today, girl. We got on the blue jeans. And I was so happy when I found these because I could not find these jeans to save my life. They are from Shein. And let me back up with these balloons. Is this going to work? No, I don't think it's going to work. Okay. So here are the jeans, y'all. They fit so good. And they're like bell bottoms. And these shoes are not comfortable whatsoever. So I just ordered me some. They're like running shoes. But they're Adidas. They like really comfortable. They were two hundred dollars, girl. <sighs> but with my shoe size, like almost all my shoes are two hundred dollars, which is crazy. But that's just what it is. I think I'm gonna just get me a peach. I promise I'm not on no skinny girl stuff. I'm just not hungry. And then I got me like these healthy little cracker thingies that my grandpa put me on hinky oh you so chase me girl oh he's so precious <laughs> she's so precious all the time so y'all these right here are the bars that i am talking about they are so good and they give you energy so we love that They are perfect just for a little snack. And I'm still eating my peach. Oh, y'all, I don't forgot my dog had ran out. Bailey, get, get the little bear boy. Yeah. So annoying. Ooh, baby, it's giving golden hour. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, anyway. So y'all, somebody made a goodie bag for the staff and there's a um, pretzel, Skittles. And girl, look at this. Tell me why this is a pen. This is a whole pen. And then some little fruit snacks and what is this? <laughs> Not the vitamin C. Ah, oh, that's a red flag knowing i'm about to be sick up here oh my goodness and we always gotta put on that lip gloss i don't care mm. i lost my clear one like bummer bummer okay girl let's go let's go let's go Huge 
tub of candy, girl. So, one of the scriptures say, oh my goodness, it came off. Okay. One of them says, I am the only way to God in the real truth. What well, Jesus says to everyone, I am the only way to God in the real truth. The real life, no one comes to the Father but through me. John chapter 14, chapter 6. And then let's see if we can find the other one. Um, Be clean. This is my favorite one. Be clean in, in the way that you live. Stop doing wrong things. Make your minds clean. You cannot love sin and love God at the same time. So, it ain't nobody perfect though. But you definitely want to definitely want to strive to be more like Jesus, okay? You want to strive to be the best woman of God or best man of God that you can be. You know what I'm saying? It's me. Yay. Yeah. So, uh, I don't see no trick-or-treaters out, and it's already oh, dang near 6 o'clock, so where the trick-or-treaters at, huh? Where y'all at? But I'm finna be out there. Y'all just wait on me. I got some sweet for the kids. <laughs> I got some sweet for the kids. Yeah. Oh, I think I see one. Move, Bailey. Oh, I'm a mess. Here, I got some. Y'all, it ain't no trick or treaters. It's, an, it's another little boy out here trying to pass out candy. It, right. Where are they at? Or maybe, we, have you walked down there? No. Do you want to walk down there? Okay. We can walk down there together. Yeah. Trick or treat. God bless you. <laughs> I should have put on Crocs. So I've given away about like five things of the good candy, as you can see. Um, there's one of them. Those are my friends, y'all. <laughs> yes, you have. Yes, you have. I mean, I need one. But there was another man sitting in his yard. Um, he's also giving out candy. Yes, yeah, for my YouTube channel. Hello. Hello. I have a YouTube channel too. Really? Yes. Shout it out. Dark Gundam's YouTube. Yeah. But yeah, it was this man. He was also passing out candy. He was like, it's been like this for a couple of years. Like, which is good. Shoot. Y'all going y'all going home? Okay. I'm tired, shoot. Whew, I might as well just leave this sitting on my porch. I didn't just just got off work. Okay, hey, they gonna take all the scriptures. Do you hear me? Let's hope they will read it, okay? Y'all, don't mind the GPS, but I most <laughs> definitely changed sign. my mind right about wanting to go get then L.A. Right Fisherman. Girl, you just doing a lot. Stop. If anything, just wait till Friday. So that's what I'm gonna do. Just wait till Friday. My favorite old couple. Bye. Oh, I love him so much, y'all. <laughs> He's the sweetest At the thing stop ever. sign, turn right oh, onto girl, FM 762. They are the sweetest. Turn right. Turn right. Boulevard. So did I say I was going to go pick up my bracelet? If I didn't say it, I'm saying it right now. Yes, girl. I'm so excited. So the charm bracelet that I got, no, the charm that I got was, um, it says god is within her she would not fall i know that's right i know that's right okay i'm speeding a little bit so we gonna turn it down Woo. hold on, on y'all because i need my my gps oh i guess i can just hear my gps but no i like to look at my gps i'm just doing stuff i'm sorry y'all the sky is so pretty. Here to pick up my bracelet. Oh, I gotta get that receipt. Is this it? Yes, it is. Hi, I'm coming to pick up my bracelet. Hi. Yes. Sorry, it's all balled up. So let me show y'all the one that I got. Where is it? This one right here, God is within her. Right there. 
So those of you who don't know what James Avery is, it's really a Texas thing. So these are just the charms. And here are some of the rings, the necklaces, some bracelets. Y'all do not mind my nails, okay? I need to cut them so bad, but y'all look how pretty look how pretty i love it and they even cleaned it for me oh yes ma'am yes ma'am she also gave me this little baggie so i can put my bracelet in it's so shiny okay i usually like to wear it on this hand so oh girl Okay, usually I can get it on the first try. Let's see if that's gonna happen. It's probably not because I didn't groom not my nails. They are too long. Entirely too long. Jesus, help me please. Help me. But yeah, I called my granny and I asked her if there were any trick-or-treaters over there. And she said no, like, I guess people just do trick-or-treating with their family or have like a family get together with friends. Uh, I don't know because I know when the parents were coming to pick up their kids, I know like two of the parents said, you ready to go to the Halloween party? So maybe like since COVID started, they've been doing that instead of, okay, I'm not even gonna try. We just gonna wait till I get home, but look how pretty it looks. Oh my goodness, we love it. But y'all, before I go, I want I want to talk about another teacher that I was working with that was in the same classroom as me. This, first of all, this lady was just, I mean, she's cool. Like, everybody's cool. Like, everybody's get alongable. Like, you know, she's an older lady. And she, to me, she was just complaining and just had the, ugh, type of attitude, like, you gotta come here every day like that sucks that you got this type of attitude like get it together get it together like i don't like that at all like mm -mm. and i mean i understand you probably tired this and the third but like please for the sake of others stop it with the nasty attitude you know what i'm saying but for real though, people need to talk to the Lord. Find a peace, okay? Because he gives you peace, baby. He gives you joy, okay? And let me tell y'all, a lot of people connect following God and being a Christian to like old age. And l let me tell you why people do that. Because a lot of people don't realize that god is our comfort that he is our everything so they go throughout their whole life they they teenagers they they 20s going through life with their own understanding and really mentally struggling really mentally depressed and all this other stuff and and looking to money um as their happiness or putting money before god that that's their idols putting sex and all types of other stuff before him and that's another thing god hates when we put things before him like he talked about in um was it jeremiah jeremiah yeah um jerusalem the people of jerusalem would worship idols and so those idols are money and sex and food and our boyfriends and basically anything that you put before god so where was i going with this yeah so with all age people connect being a christian not being a christian but spirituality and like just really being yoked up with god they they compare that to like old age or like if you're young doing it it's like you you doing too much like bro enjoy enjoy your um young years you know like i have never been this happy like i would much rather live the boring life than to be at every club at every party broken inside no ma'am no ma'am it won't be me do you hear me it won't be me 
Hallelujah. Ah, I love Jesus so much, y'all. I, I really, really do. And he is really blessing me beyond measures. Like, oh my goodness. Like, ah. so good, y'all. And he is waiting with open arms for his children to come back to him. Don't put that lifestyle of sin before God. Don't think, oh, I'm just young. I'm going to just live how I want to live. You know, I'm going to go through life with my own understanding and, and, and with my own righteous behaviors. And people be like, oh, I'm a, I'm a good person. Oh, I'm going to make it into heaven. Hmm? Huh? Baby, no. No, on judgment day, God God is is he's going to look at your life, the, the fruits that you bear, what 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 you did in your life, not not if you you think you a good person. No. You you can't go up to God and be like, "God, I'm a good person. I'm nice to people. Um I I'm I'm nice. I'm a good person. Can I can I come into heaven?" No, my ch I I never knew you depart from me and that's something you never want to hear like oh my goodness you do not want to hear that baby okay because baby you will burn 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 hey you will burn you will burn. that's not even nothing to be joking about but no all seriously though like God, God wants nothing more. My, my aunt is calling me, but um, God wants nothing more. But for us to come to Him, He He would hate to throw us in the lake of fire. But hey, that's where a lot of people go. But. Uh, God is good. He's so good. But let me go, y'all. Like, I've been sitting here wasting gas. Let me go. God bless y'all. I don't think I'm going to go get me anything to eat, matter of fact. No, girl. You finna eat at home. What are you doing? We're saving money. Yes, ma'am. Okay, let's go, y'all. Mwah. I love y'all so Y'all, I think I got some people coming up. I think. Oh, yeah. It's a lot of them. Yay. Finally, you look! Yay! <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. I read it. Oh, okay. I'll read it to you at the house. Bye-bye. Right. God bless y'all. Yeah, Alright, y'all. So, I found me something to eat. I got me some pork chops up in here. I'm about to fry these up. I need to turn the heat up. I like it! Thank you, Mr. Avi. <laughs> but so I'm gonna fry these pork chops and then I'm gonna cut them up in my salad. It's gonna be so good with some ranch. Yeah. <laughs> pork chops. Now some of y'all may think it's a little burnt or it's like this is just how I like my pork chops. Then I'm gonna piece them up in my salad. This salad is actually perfection. Like, hold on, y'all. Let me turn on the light. See, y'all, I got some lettuce at the bottom, obviously, and then I cut up the fried pork chop, and then I drizzled some ranch on it, and my mama has some pico de gallo sitting around, so I decided to add that. That's new. I've never had pico de gallo on it, but yeah, this is the fried pork chop salad. Uh, I don't know if anybody has ever had a fried pork chop salad before but um yeah y'all go ahead and try it it looks so good my foot cramping up mm-hmm mm-hmm right, so i'm about to finish up my dinner and then i'm going to take a shower and 
you know, have my time with the Lord. And then um, I'm going to sleep. So if you guys enjoyed this little vlog, please be sure to give me a big thumbs up and subscribe. I feel like I just look a hot mess. Boy, y'all.